Hey, how's it going? Chris here in my bedroom. Uh, moved the 24 volt portable solar generator in this little cubby hole here I had in the corner. And the whole goal was to fire up this 8,000 cooling BTU window air conditioner off this generator. And I am happy to say I got it hooked up this morning and it is working beautifully. Beautifully, beautifully, beautifully. The only thing I don't like is every time the compressor kicks on the inverter beep and while we're videotaping this well I may be able to force it here and I'll show you what I mean but uh, yeah this works good I, I'm using two of these window AC units essentially to cool the house uh, it won't fire up the big 1 ton 12,000 cooling BTU air conditioner but it will fire up this one so hallelujah on this deal and it's still a little tacky here I still need to clean up all this here but I have as you can see outside the window there maybe I've got 400 watts of solar panels hooked up to this solar generator yes the windows are dirty looks really bad this will all be cleaned up but essentially uh, this go power inverter, pure sine wave, 1500 watt, will fire up this 8000 cooling BTU air conditioner, which obviously the cat loves cool air. So, that's about it. I'm not going to get too detailed in here. Now you, you're thinking, yeah, this air conditioner, air conditioner uh, the startup is probably right around 1500 to 2000 watts. But while it's running, it's only using about 650 watts. And you're probably scratching your head, well, he's only got 400 watts of solar panels hooked up to it. Well, that's okay. Because it's not continuously running at 650 watts. Uh, so right now, it's just the fan blowing on here, which uses maybe like 30 or 40 watts. But when you have continuous sun, I mean, you're, you're charging batteries. I'm at 25.53 right now. So, here, I'm going to kick the uh, temperature down and see if you can hear this thing chirp when it kicks on, okay? Hear it? Well, it kind of buzzed, but uh, it didn't get, it doesn't get pissed off. I like this inverter, but this type of inverter does not have... A really large surge capacity on it and that's one thing I do not like about this everything else is great on it but uh, just a word of caution when you're searching for an inverter this is a 24 volt inverter um, it doesn't have a lot of headroom it doesn't it doesn't it doesn't like starting up compressors uh, much larger than this for that matter but uh, I would definitely if I was gonna get another one get one with a very very high startup surge capacity other than that, it's fine. So, yep, it's cooling. It's cooling. Kick it down to 70. Fantastic. Fantastic. I don't think I'm going to plug anything else into this uh, unit, but uh, that was the whole goal is to get this thing fired up and rock and rolling. All right. Thanks for watching. See ya! Hot town, summer in the city, back of my neck.